Welcome to Industrial Cleaning Equipment's training video on the ice scrub. If your ice scrub arrives via courier, it will do so in a box like this. The machine will arrive fully assembled with the battery, battery charger and pad also within the box. To remove the ice scrub, please lift using the handle here. The ice scrub will arrive with a lithium iron battery with a runtime of one hour. To insert the battery, go to the rear of the machine, squeeze the two buttons, slide, push in place. When you need to charge the machine, please use the external charger provided. Ensure it's plugged into the mains and the switch is turned on. Before lowering the battery into the dock. The red light will come on when the machine is charging. To attach your pad or brush drive, simply tilt the machine onto its back and line up the hole with the drive board and push off. The ice scrub has a clean and dirty water tank. To access these tanks, lift the control panel by squeezing this trigger. To remove the tanks, unclip on each side. The dirty water tank is on the top of the machine with the fresh water tank directly below. To fill, simply remove this cap and pour in the water. To empty the recovery tank, please ensure these clips are fastened for lifting and removing the cap to pour away the water. To operate the machine, squeeze this lever and pull the control panel back before turning on using the foot pedal provided. Please ensure the squeegee blade is turned down for optimal suction. The control panel is very user friendly. This one here will turn the vacuum on or off. This one here is your water control setting, either one, two or three and the eco mode determines how strong the vacuum is. All of these will engage when you squeeze the trigger behind the paddle itself. The ice scrub is also fitted with a unique feature which enables it to clean going backwards. Simply tilt the indoor back and the squeegee blade will spin round enabling you to clean backwards. To return it the other way, simply manoeuvre the machine and spin it round. This may take a couple of attempts to perfect. When you finish using the machine, please ensure you take off the pad or brush and rinse clear, and also wipe through the squeegee blade to remove any dirt or debris that may have been collected. The squeegee blade is actually removable by turning these two clips here and pulling out. Please ensure that after every use, you're checking the clean and dirty water filters for blockages and debris. These are accessible by removing these clips here, removing the recovery tank, unclipping the lid, and cleaning. The clean water filter is located under the clean water tank, directly below the serial number of the machine. Simply pull it out, make sure it's washed through after every use as chemical will build up.